Hello, I am David W. Parker, and this is Programming Today I Learned, WebGL series, episode 20. We're going to be looking at GL.Triangle Strip. It's going to be another short one since we have continuing on with the same pattern we've been for the last several episodes. Everything here is the same until we get to the draw line, draw arrays, GL.Triangle Strip. And once again, we just have a list of vertices here by pairs. So these are sets of two. And if we have n is 3, we'll see we're just drawing a simple triangle from 1, 2, 3 for those three locations with this being 0, 0. And if we go to the, add the fourth value, you will see, as we refresh this, um, I have to save the file. <laughs> so we'll see 1, 2, 3, and then it'll use the last two uh, vertices with the new one. So the next line will use this vertex and this vertex, or n is 5. So it'll be here, here, and here. And the next one will use these two vertices to draw this triangle. So you have all these different triangles being drawn uh, continuously using the last two points. So you have a triangle here, you have a triangle here, you have a triangle here, and you have the initial triangle. Always, as you go out of bounds, it won't draw anything, and it'll set throw an error. So that's about it for this particular episode. Uh, again, if you wanted to uh, add three here, you could use three points uh, in three-dimensional space. And uh, but that's it for this episode. Uh, keeping it nice and short. Uh, if you like what you saw today, please share this on social media, like the video, subscribe, and if you'd like to check out my newsletter. Uh, we'll be sending that out soon, and you can sign up for that at programmingtil.com. Thanks, and have a great one.